said I was going to document this journey, even the hiccups, and it is day five, and I am currently pacing around my room because I have a freaking cramped Charlie horse in my stomach. <sighs> I just drank some water and took my magnesium pills for today, but yeah, this is not fun. I just peeled the grapefruit. I think I'm gonna eat a grapefruit. Um, I know this is supposed to be a 10 day water cleanse, but whew, I think my body is telling me I need something else. So I did promise myself that getting on this, I said, Nicole, you're just gonna be intuitive and listen to your body. And since I don't have a banana, which is what I really think I need, some potassium, I am going to, Eat this grapefruit because I have a grapefruit. Yeah, because I even feel like my um legs kind of tightening up. So yeah. But this whole time I've been taking vitamins. Whew. I will show y'all my stomach, but I don't have no shirt on or clothes on. I'm a resident nudist. So, um, because it's like moving around. You would think it's that I'm pregnant with a baby. That's how the muscle is just tightening and moving around like a Charlie horse. It's crazy, but y'all, one day at a time, I just told myself, I just, I just want to lay down, and when I laid down, it like, it just caught again, so I'm about to drink some more water, eat this grapefruit, and I'll check back in later and let you know how I'm doing. Listen, the way my body just responded to half a grapefruit in less than a minute, the cramp let go immediately now I could lay down like my lips slightly burning but I always been I think slightly allergic to uh <laughs> grapefruits but I like grapefruits fun fact I'm not a huge fruit eater I like tart fruits more than anything I like grapefruits I like lemons I like cherries I like cranberries um and I eat bananas um every now and again but those are the only fruit I really eat. I go on spells sometimes and eat watermelon too. I like watermelon. But yeah, as for like buying apples and oranges and all that, that's not my ministry. I mean, I will eat it if like it's if I'm somewhere or it's there or it's offered, I'll eat it. But it's not anything that I really buy because oranges, apples, anything like that will go bad in my house because it's not going to get eaten. So yeah, um, same with grapes. I need me a nap, so I'm going to take me a nap right now. I feel my eyes closing right now. I woke up, I set my alarm to wake up at like 5.30 this morning because I had some projects I need to finish. Some video editing for some clients, some other stuff. I took like three phone call meetings today. So, yeah, um, I'm tired. I knew I was going to need a nap, though. So, it's like a little bit after 3 o'clock. I'm going to take me a nap, and then once I wake up, I'll do, like, the next shift. But that grapefruit just saved my life from this doggone, um, I can't even thank y'all. Cramp. Cramp. Uh, yeah, I'll check back in and do, like, an official update of how I really feel, um, day five. But that was just an episode I wanted to definitely catch on camera because, boy, oh, boy, that, that, that cramp was no joke. And I had a cramp yesterday in my stomach, but it wasn't as bad as that one. That one didn't even let me lay down. So, we're in the bed. About to get some shut eye. All right, good people. Yo, listen. Let me actually let my hair down. So, it is 5.52 on a Thursday afternoon. Well, evening now. And I am just getting out of my house. Uh, for today. Why, you ask? <sighs> Checking back in. It's still day five. And baby, let me tell you something. I just made me a salad to eat. <laughs> because number one, I want the salad. Number two, today is the first day where I felt like super, super weak and kind of like loopy, kind of out of it. Like, I came earlier and told y'all about me eating the, um, let me, hold on. 
I came earlier about me eating. No, oh, that's worse. I came early about me eating the um half a grapefruit. Here's the other half of my grapefruit. I bought that just in case, you know, I wanted that and I got salad dressing on it because I put it in my salad plate. So yeah, y'all. You're probably asking like, Nicole, why are you outside in your car eating a salad you made at your house? Good question. I felt the urge to go get a salad, purchase a salad, but then I realized I had everything in my house for salads because salads is one of my favorite things to eat. But anyway, I'm coming on here vlogging about this situation before I actually partake in this salad because... I just had like a, a emotional experience, like for real, for real, like almost like not a panic attack, but I literally like started shaking as I was making this salad. And I was like, what the is going on with me? Like I really was having an emotional reaction to eating or the idea of me eating um, uh, before, before the 10 day goal that I set for myself. And um, yeah. I don't know. I think I was just like scared to do it. But at the same time, like I said, I, t I said in this video, I don't know if I said it in the first video or not, but I promised myself when I said I'm going to start fasting. Um, at first, I didn't have a time limit. I was just like, I felt sick that day. So I did not eat. And then I just kept it going. That was the reason for me fasting because I had just my eating had been effed up for a long time. And then all of a sudden, um, it just came to a peak and I was like, Nicole, this has got to stop. So I didn't eat that day and I just kept it going. And then I think on the second day, I was like, I'm gonna do 10 days. Yeah. So that's when I kind of made the uh, goal that I'm gonna do 10 days and I'm still gonna do 10 days. But um, today, right now, I'm gonna eat this salad because like I said, today is the first day that I feel like kind of out of it. Like I did a lot of work and like, I can't, I just told y'all I was about to take a nap. Ask me not to take a nap. No, I didn't take a nap. So, I'm still here, minus a nap. My body cramped up again in the bed. Um, so, I had to, like, roll around and, you know, find comfort from that for about, like, 45 minutes. And, I don't know, I just feel... It's weird. Stomach's still gassing. It's weird. Like, I feel energetic and lethargic at the same time it's the weirdest combination i've never felt like this before like i know my body has everything it needs because i've been taking my vitamins while i've been on this so it's been water and vitamins that i've been taking um and in another video i'll show you guys what vitamins i've been taking for this but it's been water and vitamins so i know that i have the nutrients and listen my body got plenty of fat storage to feed on so it ain't lacking fat but boy like that emotional toll like i literally had like a moment almost like a panic attack and i have in the past uh been a i have in the past experienced like panic attacks so i know what that feels like so yeah Whew. but anyway let's get into this salad i'm about to eat so can y'all see this oh it's gonna be so good i already know it's gonna be good hopefully there we go so I'm gonna tell you what's on top of this. Remember, if you watch the vlogs, on day three, I dreamed about romaine lettuce and red onions. So of course I got some red onions, romaine lettuce. Also, some vegan cheese, and my roommate had cooked some um, salmon the other day. Like she put some salmon in the uh, oven. So I put a little bit of that on here. And then I have some vegan ranch dressing. Um, I'm kind of upset because I didn't have the um, Italian dress. I didn't have any more Italian dressing, which I always have at my house. But I didn't have any Italian dressing. Um, and like I told you, people who put one dressing on their salad can't be trusted. Like, you have to put two dressings. So I have the vegan, um, follow your heart, vegan ranch dressing. And I mixed a little bit of the... Um, Catalina where it's the Walmart brand Catalina so basically the California style French and y'all let's see how my body reacts and I still like I told, showed you earlier I still have my other um piece of grapefruit that I ate earlier to subside the stomach cramps listen bite number one let's see mmm 
This is delicious. This is mother effing delicious. Wow, that's really it. And of course, trusty bottle of water here. Ah, oh, it's just being been me in these Publix waters. <laughs> that's my favorite water, by the way. Fun fact: Publix spring water. Second runner up is uh, Smart Water. Those are my two favorite waters. But Publix spring water always comes in for the win. This is from my dream. These dogs, I never put red onions on salad, but this tastes amazing. Like my subconscious was really trying to tell me, girl, put some red onions on your salad. It's a game changer. Oh, and also the romaine lettuce I had, had cabbage and carrots in there. Purple cabbage and carrots, so some of that in here too. These onions are good in here. Oh my goodness. And usually I do like the fried onions. Like the onions you put on top of the uh, casserole, green bean casserole during the holiday. But I never did fresh onions and this is amazing. Oh, and I know. Research experts on fast they tell you to break your fast with a smoothie or with liquid this is what my body wanted so that's what I'm eating it's very good because what my mind told me to go get was to go get a salad from Zaxby's with fried chicken with cheese with uh I mix their dresses too with the French and the vinaigrette. I think it's like a strawberry vinaigrette they have that I mix up. But I just knew good and well because I stopped eating fried chicken. Well, I stopped eating chicken for like two months. Two months ago, I stopped eating chicken. And then I gradually, right before I did this fast, I gradually added chicken back into my diet and realized that it was just the fried version that wasn't agreeing with me because, yeah. So I was going to take the plunge and eat the dog on that's a good that was a good screenshot um take the plunge eat the fried chicken and know my stomach was gonna be upset but no nah. i was like no you got everything you want here and you got red onions so we there y'all eating i'll check back in and let you know how i feel after i finish this y'all I was three bites into my salad, literally three bites. I took two on camera and one after I got off camera. I feel like I gotta go to the bathroom now. But, it's so like, I just drove home. Side note, this is the first time I'm getting out of my house if I didn't say this in the beginning. So I decided just to drive somewhere and eat my salad in my car. That's why I came to my house. That's why I didn't eat the salad in the house because I've been at my house all day. I literally been naked in my house all day doing work. And I decided to put on some clothes and come outside. So, yeah. Um, now I feel like I got to go to the bathroom, which I'm excited about because I did not go to the bathroom yet today. And when I say the bathroom, I mean number two today. And I, like I told you in day one or two or whatever, yesterday when I went and got the magnesium pills, which I did take today, um... I'm, I'm regular. I'm very regular. So I never have an issue going to the bathroom. So I don't like being on cleanses and I don't use the bathroom. Like that kind of bugs me not to go to the bathroom every day. Like that, yeah. So I'm feeling like this salad about to get me together because I feel my stomach doing this little thug thizzle. Like, yeah. Anyway, uh, before I close this out officially, um, symptoms for today. Today's symptoms. Like I said earlier, I felt a little loopy and kind of out of it and kind of weak, but not, but like I said, it was a mixture between weak and uh, look how freaking skinny my fingers are. I told y'all I lose weight in my fingers first. My fingers don't never be this skinny. They always be fat and like that. That's how they be looking, but together. 
But yeah, they are slim, baby. Slim fingers. But anyway, um, and I got little fat hands, but my fingers are slimming down. But anyway, um, I even see my dog on knuckles. I don't never see my knuckles like that. Girl! Anyway, um, <laughs> simplest for today, feeling loopy, feeling energetic, yet lethargic at the same time. Very weird combination. Um, stomach cramps. You saw me go through one of them after I got off camera, after eating that half of grapefruit, which I still have the other half here. I don't know if I'm actually eat it. After eating that half of grapefruit, went through another episode of stomach cramps. Um, yeah, was chugging water per usual. Uh, symptoms, symptoms, symptoms. What other symptoms? Um, that emotional fit I had when I was making a salad. I don't know if that was because I was anxious about making a salad to eat it or what, but it was an emotional fit that I usually don't have when it comes to eating food. So that was kind of like, whoo, what's going on here? Uh, symptoms. No headaches, no nothing like that. Oh, twice I got up um, from a seated position, seated position. I got up from my desk twice and got really dizzy. Like I had to stop dizzy. Like my heart started beating kind of fast today. And I was like, whoo, like I had to stand up and like put my head down just a little bit to catch my bearings. But when I got up from a laid down position from out of my bed, I was fine. So something about the seated position, it may be because my eyes had been on a computer all day. I don't know what it was, but I felt like dizziness immediately. Um, I think that's it. Oh, lastly, but not least, I have been feeling like freezing cold. Like I've been like cold, cold, cold. And like I told you, that's very weird for me because I'm normally like hot natured, but I've been cold, especially today. I've been really cold. So we should, we shall see what happens tomorrow. Day six, um, planning on just drinking water tomorrow and we'll see what my body says tomorrow. Um, sorry. My nose itch. Um, we'll see what my body says tomorrow because um, I think it's a day by day thing and I'm not going to uh, count myself out of a water fast because I ate a salad because, hey, we five days in, baby. So yeah, but that salad was delicious. Um, I feel satisfied. I don't feel like bloated and full like I normally used to eat, but I feel satisfied with that salad. So I'm gonna go upstairs, I'm gonna drink the rest of this water. I might chill in my car a little bit. I like sitting in my car. I might chill in my car a little bit longer um, because I have not been outside all day, even though it's about to get dark soon. And then I'm going inside, take a shower, and officially wind down for today. Day five, people.